doing? Ha! She was trying to rob me. Watch out! That is not true. I was just trying to get my coin and... What I... are you doing here? I'm here to wash my clothes. How can anyone use a machine after someone like you? I don't even know what to say. Is there a problem here? Yes! yes. Oh. Woody, when are you going to be more attentive? What's wrong? Why did you let a thief in here? If I wasn't watching, she would have slipped into my bag. I wasn't stealing anything. I just got my coin, that's it. Uh -huh. And some of my stuff as well. Get her out of here. Uh, I, I guess I sh should figure it out first. So. Okay. What are you going to do? Uh. What are you doing? I'm going to print it out and hang it at the entrance. Uh, let, let's talk for a second. Mm -hmm. This behavior? This is unacceptable. This is unacceptable behavior. I agree. I agree. I totally agree. But you see, there are people you cannot prove anything to. So you're really kicking me out? What? No, 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 no. I suggest that you can leave me all the stuff you need washed. I will wash myself for free and send it to your address. Sounds good. But why do I have to go? Because I, I see I can rely on you. If I ask her to leave, she will make a huge scene and screw up everything. Don't let her hang up my picture at the entrance. Sure. Sure. Sorry for the inconvenience. Hello? Hi, is this Chloe? Uh, yes, that's me. Did you take some clothes to the laundry today, but got someone else's bag instead? I took your number in the laundry room, so we can exchange packages. Woody's such a moron. I can come to you today. Okay, I'll send you my address. So, you did laundry after all? Yeah. Against all odds. Well, I'll talk to Woody later. Where are my clothes? They are in... Wait a second. Why it's open? Because I thought my clothes were in there, and then you call. <laughs> yeah, of course. Before I leave, I want to check that everything is there. I knew that. What's up? Where are they? They? My panties are gone. Give them back. What are you even saying? I, why are you so rude? Now you listen. These pink Victoria's Secret panties were given to me by my husband. And all your dirty rags combined are cheaper than these panties. You got it? So you better give them back before I get really angry. Look, I do not have them. They're probably mixed up in the bag or lost at the laundromat. Mm -hmm. You got what you wanted, thief? Don't talk to me like that. I'm a grown woman. Enough. I'm sure they're in here, and I cannot wait any longer. Where are you going? To the toilet. Listen, as I said, I think they're in... What are you doing? I'm gonna find my panties, whether you like it or not. This is my bedroom. And somewhere in here are my panties. Why do you think you have the right to search in here? Oh, how you all like to talk about rights. If people like you were banned from using public places, everyone would live much better. What are you trying to say? That society has made a huge mistake by giving you rights to go freely, committing crimes against decent people. I'm calling the police to end the charade. Perfect. They're gonna help me a lot. I'm gonna find it much faster with them. I got it. They're on you now. On me? Yes. That's why you're so calm. 
Do you think I'm so stupid that I couldn't guess? Take your pants off. <laughs> no way. You heard me. So you really trying to force me to take off my pants against my will? Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. Take them off. These are not mine. Really? Maybe someone else's? Huh? Honey, I'm home. This is for him. Let's go and see who you're stealing for. <laughs> okay. Huh. What's going on here? Um, it's a funny story. We met the laundry and your wife. Wife? I asked her to, to show me a new pair of jeans. Oh. So that's what you call accusing me of theft? Yeah. Threatening me? And accusing me and forcing me to undress myself in my own house? What? Karen, tell me right now what you did here. Uh, Mr. Bannett, this is a joke. Nothing like this happened. You know, our clothes were mixed up in the laundry room, but then we, we figured it out. Mr. Bennett, do you guys know each other? Yeah. Karen works for me. Yeah, it's a coincidence. I'm so embarrassed, I'm so upset, and they were my favorites, you know, I'm like, enough! That's how everything worked out. That's why you're so cold. Do you think I'm so stupid that I couldn't guess? Put them off. <laughs> no way. And that's what I've been all along. Racism has prevented you from seeing anything clearly. Oh, I... No! Karen, you've only humiliated yourself today. Due to your crooked worldview and your racism, you've only committed crimes. I'm just so emotional. It happens. I don't want to see you in the office ever again. Understood? Where do you think you're going? We're calling the police and we're going to wait here together. <laughs>